Welcome to Inspire for Travel. My name is Wemba Imani and today I'm currently outside the Milimani shopping mall. Now this is one of the more upscale shopping malls here in Dar es Salaam, Tanzania. And if you're looking for a place where you can go and perhaps see shops and restaurants you are familiar to, then Milimani shopping mall will be a good place for you to start with. Is it a Dubai of Africa? Who knows? We'll be walking around, checking the vibes of the place, seeing what shops and restaurants are available, so you can get a full idea of what to expect if you visit Milimani Shopping Mall. Now, before I go further, I'll appreciate it if you can like, share, and subscribe to the channel by clicking on the red box below this video. And if you're new to the channel, welcome to Inspire for Travel, and to my returning subscribers, thank you for your custom. Let's explore Milimani Shopping Mall. Milimani City Shopping Mall is on Sam Nujoma Road, Ubango, Dar es Salaam. It is one of the largest malls in the country, with an area of over 320,000 square feet. The opening ceremony was in November 2006. Milimani City is home to several retail stores, restaurants, and a movie theater called Century Cinemax. There are several telecommunication service providers based in the mall, like Airtel, Tigo, and Vodacom. The mall has a huge parking lot. It also has branches from several banks, building societies together with ATMs. So upon entry to the Milimani shopping mall, we're already seeing restaurants and shops we're familiarized to. For example, here is the F Pizza Hut and Subway. And this is Grano Coffee. So, you know, if you're a person that's not really trying to perhaps explore more of the local type of vibe, then Mili Imani Shopping Mall will be a place where you may appreciate more given the fact that it will be things that you are familiar to. So, let's carry on walking. I'm very much impressed with the car park here. Everything is such organ in an organized fashion. Everything is really organized. And, you know, so far, so good. So before we actually go inside the shopping mall, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to walk further down and then we'll see more of the shops that are on the outside. So for example, as I'm seeing here right now on the right, there's actually something called the DR Sweets. Now this is a, of course an ice cream parlor where you can actually come and have your ice cream. And right next to it, there's something called Papa Roti and I'm sure you can get coffee and different things like that. And a good thing about some of these shops here, you can pay by card. So for example, if you haven't got Tanzanian shillings or cash on you, you can use your MasterCard or Visa card. So that's quite convenient, especially if you're just landing in the country, you're not here for long and you haven't did your currency exchange as yet, it will be a good option if you can pay by card. And that's one of the things you will see actually when you come to the Milimani shopping mall you get an opportunity to pay for things via card now it's a real nice chill out vibe here at the mall you can see like over here people are just sitting enjoying a meal having a nice drink and stuff like that and you you know the weather here is quite warm so sitting outside you you do feel the nice cool breeze and everything like that so that's a nice experience when you visit here and taking the vibes and for those who are coming with children, we're going to be walking to a, a, like something like a mini fun fair where kids can enjoy rides and different things. This is right here on the left here, so actually children can play. It's quite quiet at the moment, but they're still open. And I guess if you go in there with your children, then you can pay and you can use the ride. So that's really nice that you can actually do that. And a lot of the food here, you know, different variety of foods. Of course, you can get tea, coffee, local fruit juices, and different things like that. So if you're wondering what you will get, these are some of the things that you can get here. And 
as I'm walking forward now, I'm actually noticing that there's another side to the mall. Now, this mall is actually quite big and you can find game and other supermarkets. So you can do your shopping here as well. So, for example, if you haven't um, been to a supermarket here before, then you can definitely use the supermarkets that are available here at the mall. So that's really nice. I'm liking the vibes so far and everything seems quite orderly well put together very nice calm atmosphere at Milimani shopping mall so I'm liking the vibe now over here we can see there's like a ATM where you can take out money so if you're wondering if you come here can you use the ATM yes you can you can use the ATM take out your cash and different things like that so that's really good Now mind you, I'm, I'm still walking on the outside of the mall. I'm not walking inside as yet, but it's, it's quite a big mall actually, you know? And as far as the eyes can see where my finger just pointed, that's all part of the mall here. And you can get grilled food, local fruit juices and all of that, like even over here, that's what they're selling here. These are all local fruit juices and different things that you can buy if you come here. There's also a Turkish restaurant. So for those who, you know, you're a bit more, you're not so rigid in terms of your diet and you're willing to try different foods, then there's clearly a variety of foods here at this shopping mall. Because right in front of me here, this is actually a Turkish restaurant and they do coffee as well and to my left here this is the Milimani conference center so I'm sure they have conferences and different things like that here in Milimani so very very interested very much impressed with the vibe just look at the view of what you can see of this amazing shopping mall they have the palm trees and different things like that I must say it's a very nice calm atmosphere here at the Milimani shopping mall so definitely if you're out here in Dar es Salaam Give it a try, check it out. Of course, it will be one of the more upscale places, so you don't really get that, um, what would I say, local flavor, like if you go to another place where, where, where there are more locals, but you will still experience some bit of it because a lot of people come in here, of course, Tanzanians, but if you're looking for a much more real deep local vibe, then you may want to go somewhere else. Nevertheless, the vibe is still nice here, it's calm, and we're gonna go inside and explore more of the Milimani shopping mall. So you wanna watch this video till the end because you won't be disappointed. Let's uh, carry on exploring Milimani shopping mall. So we're currently walking inside the Milimani shopping mall and already I'm liking the vibe here. It's very much put together. And it's, it has that feel like any other large shopping mall that you may experience in Europe, the United States. So definitely you get that vibe coming in here. It's quite big, it's long. There's a nice traffic of people that are actually walking in. Now before you come in, you have to, of course, sanitize your hands. And then you can, if you have a bag on you, then there's a machine that you'll have to push it through. And then just obviously to check to see if you, have, if you haven't got anything illegal on you. But apart from that, everything is fine. And yeah, this is the vibe in here so far. I'm going to turn the camera so you'll get to experience what I'm seeing right now. So, of course, Christmas is being prepared for here in Africa. Um, clearly, from what I'm seeing, there's a lot of, you know, things like Christmas trees and things like that. So, yeah, that's the vibe. So it's very much a modern shopping mall here, very modern, well put together and let's see some of the shops where you can see here. So here for example you have Eye Emporium and you can get your lenses, glasses and things like that. LG also have their shop here and you can get their fridges, washing machines and different things like that. So if you're a fan of LG and you like their products and stuff like that, then boom you're at the right place. Of course you can get things like shoes for kids, school shoes and different things like that. 
So this is what you see inside the Millie Money shopping mall. Now right here of course is your modern shoots, uh, supermarket and it's called Shoppers Supermarket and this is what it looks like. Now sh supermarkets in Africa, one thing you have to bear in mind, if you're carrying a bag you will have to leave it in the baggage section before you actually go in and shop. So this is how you will um, find in many countries on the continent of Africa when you go into a supermarket and stuff like that. So that's something you'll have to get used to. I guess they do that of course for security purposes um, so yeah perhaps if you come in and you don't really want to go through the hassle of leaving your bag in the baggage place then you could maybe just don't come with your bag just hold your purse or you know, something on you and then you can just go in shop with your things and then get your bag at a later stage it all depends on what you're doing now this is Samsung Samsung does do very good um, products they also have Sony here as well, Sony, Samsung, which is really nice, especially a lot of people have um, Samsung Android phones. So you can um, get that here at the Milimani shopping mall. Now the mall is quite big, I must say. In terms of um, wideness, I'll say it's, it's much more longer than wider but it's quite about it's, it's still quite big nevertheless but to my left here this is actually the Tigo shop and Tigo is a shop where you can actually get things like your mobile internet your data things that things like that you can also get your sim card for your phone Tigo is quite popular here in Tanzania it's more expensive than another brand called Airtel, but they do have very good internet, um, especially for the city of Dar es Salaam. This is another shop that you can get your SIM card in as well. It's called um, Airtel. Now, Airtel does provide very good um, bundles and prices. They're known to provide very reasonable prices for your internet and so on. So if you're looking for a SIM card, like I said in my previous vlog, you could definitely check out Airtel and Tigo. More fridges and washing machines. And if you're really feeling for that back home vibe, if you want to go to the cinema, there's also a cinema here at the Milimani shopping mall. This is what a cinema is like. The box office is right there. You will get your ticket, of course, and then after you will go in. Another thing you will find at the Milimani shopping mall here is things like carpets and 
different utensils for like the kitchen glasses and all of that you can find that here and you can see from the glass here there's different things for the ladies and you can pay by card as well so that's really nice so far I'm, I'm liking the vibe of what I'm seeing here at the Mini Money shopping mall it's it's a great experience and it's, it's quite calm I must say very calm day and of course there'll, there'll be a, a certain type of people that will be of course shopping here definitely it's aimed at the middle upper middle class and up right but it, it, it of course it's mirroring the vibe that you will find in the United States, Dubai, and the United Kingdom. So if you're looking for more of a cultural experience, real local cultural experience, like I was saying, probably won't get that here. But nevertheless, it's at least good to know that you have the option of finding some other things that you're used to in Tanzania. You know, on this channel, I try to show you know a, a variety of things some people may be interested in visiting open air markets flea markets and really interacting with a certain type of people some people may choose to not be interested in that and they may in be interested in visiting places like this like Minimani and you know seeing shops like and restaurants that they're used to like Pizza Hut and things like that so I'm showing you that right here is also KFC um, so some people are watching their diets some people may not eat it, but there, there is KFC available here at the Minimani shopping mall. So pretty much um, that is it, guys. I didn't really go in in some of the shops because you have to be careful in terms of filming in some shops here. But I've, I've just given you a basic idea of what it's like in the shopping malls here. So if you do decide to visit, definitely check it out and see what the vibes is like here in Tanzania. So I'm literally walking to the exit of the shopping mall here and one of the things I like about this area from what I'm seeing, yeah you see shops that you're familiar to and there's another mall which is right next to it, it's called the Sky City Mall as well so in this area you do find a lot of modern shopping venues and stuff like that so you know if you want to really see what that's like in Tanzania then yeah, definitely Milimani City, you should give it a try. Let me show you the sky mall, it's literally right in front of me and it's a high rising building, that's it right there. And you can see to the top, it says Sky City Mall. So yeah, if, you're on, if you wanna have a, a bit of a wander, you can just come down, wander around, check out the mall perhaps, check out the Sky City Mall and get a vibe of the place so this is where the cars are exiting the mall and when you do come out here you do see things like you see things like bajajis so depending on if you want to go somewhere else you can get, get a bajaji which is right outside the shopping mall that guy is actually preaching you'll see some of these things when you visit Tanzania some people are just outside a certain venue and they're just preaching and stuff like that so that's something you'll see And also here you can, I don't know how long you may be staying in Tanzania, but you can buy things for your plants. So these are all the various, these are all the various things for your plants you can buy here, the, the plant pots. They're really lovely, really colorful, has a nice cultural tone to it. So that's some of the things you can find when you come out here and right in front of me is the sky city mall this is what it's, it's, it looks like on the outside 
it will be similar vibes to the Millie Money City Mall. I wouldn't really go inside there, but similar shops that, to what you were seeing in Millie Money Shopping Mall is what you will actually find there. And these are all the local Dala Dala, they call them Dala Dala buses here in Tanzania. That's what it looks like. Another cafe where you can get local juices and things like that. You can buy different meat, you know, barbecue chicken and all of that. People are literally just sitting down here, relaxing, you know. Has a nice kind of cultural look to it, you know, the detached roof there. Really nice cultural, traditional feel. So if you're not feeling to eat in the Milimani shopping mall, you can come out here and have something to eat and drink and you can see right here you can get a beer as low as 2,000 Tanzanian shillings if you drink beer you can also get that as well so this is the outside of the Milimani shopping mall this is what it looks like So I do trust that you have enjoyed today's episode. We've explored the modern shopping style here in Tanzania. That's the Milimani shopping mall. So let me know what you think in the comment section below. Would you visit this place? Is it a place you'll be interested in? Dubai of Africa? You let me know in the comment section below. I appreciate your time. My name is Wemba Imani and thank you for watching Inspire for Travel. Do consider liking, sharing and subscribing to the channel by clicking on the red box below this video that says subscribe. Thank you.